Hello, my name is Herman Ventura, and today we'll be going over adding, subtracting fractions, and finding the common factors. So today we have the factors are the numbers you multiply to get the specific number. Common factors are factors that have the same or have the same factors. So here we have two. Uh, the factors of two are one and two. Since you multiply, you can multiply one times two to get two, but no other, no other num whole numbers multiply to get two. So then we have factors of four, which are one, two, and four. Then we have factors of ten, which is one, two, five, and ten. Then we have fifteen, which are one, three, five, and fifteen. Then we have twenty, which is one, two, four, five, ten, and twenty. So now we're going to compare the common factors of 4 and 10. So we have 4 here, and then we're going to have 10 here. So now we're going to write out all the, fact uh, the factors of each one of these numbers, which if you see here on the left, the factors are 1, 2, and 4. And then for 10, the factors are 1, 2, 5, and 10. So now, since we wrote, uh, wrote out or drew out this table, we can see easily that the common factors for 4 and 10 are 1 and 2. Now let's do 10 and 15. And this is going to be the same process as when we were comparing 4 and 10, and we're going to draw out a table. and then we're going to write out the factors of each number. So for 10, it's going to be the same numbers, 1, 2, 5, and 10. And then for 15, it's going to be the same, 1, 3, 5, and 15. So now here, we can see that 1 are common between the 2, and then we also have 5. So the common factors here are going to be 1 and 5. And I'm going to write out the common factors for 4 and 10, which are 1 and 2. So this is just an easier way to do these kind of problems if you're having um, trouble visualizing it or doing it in your head. Just write out a table and put 4 on one side, and then, or the first number on one side, and the second number on the other, and then just write out uh, in table form the factors of each, and then just see if they, they have common factors like here which makes it much simpler thank you for watching this video tutorial and keep learning